Hello everyone. Welcome back to Rachel's Nook. Today we are going to be using my Instant Pot to cook up some potatoes. So come on into the kitchen and let's get started. Okay, so we got our Instant Pot ready to go. We're going to go ahead and cook these potatoes in there. I've already got the potatoes cleaned up and I also have the water at the bottom with our little trivet. So we're going to go ahead and put these potatoes in here and get them ready. Dry my hands real quick. We've got our lid and we've got our little ring set up. Putting that in now, making sure it's secure. And then we are going to turn on the Instant Pot. I've already got it plugged in. Get that on. There we are. All right. Okay, we're going to go ahead and set the Instant Pot. You can see everything very well. So we're going to push pressure cook. And we are going to turn the knob up to 35 minutes. Like I said, I've already put the water in the bottom of the pot, put the trivet down. I've got four potatoes in there. And we are going to set the venting for it to vent. And everything else is there. Hi. And I think we're ready to go. So we're just going to go ahead and push start. There we go. And as that temperature starts rising, then this will lock down. Our lid will lock down and it will start its process. So we will come back to you in about 35 minutes when it starts its pressure release and get our potatoes out and we'll let them cool down and then we'll put them in the refrigerator. And so anytime I need a potato, they're ready to go. They're already cooked. I can just give a quick warm or put them in whatever I want to put them in. So we'll see you back in about 35 minutes. Okay, now we're up to 214 degrees and I believe it's fixing to lock the lid. It's releasing a little bit of steam on the top. I don't think you can hear it, but if you can, it's just a little steady stream of, of steam coming through and there we go and that little red light has come on and that means that the lid is locked and the lid cannot come open it's releasing steam to get to the temperature that it needs to be and we are off on cooking here in a minute it's going to change the on setting is going to change to the countdown of 35 minutes. It's definitely a great investment. And there we go. Now the countdown. So it's going to count down from 35 minutes. And when it is done, it's going to do a pressure release. And I'll come back to you then. So anyway, we got about one minute left. And the pressure will release. And I just wanted to film this so that you are you know what to expect when that happens. I know most everyone has an Instant Pot now. Mine is an Instant Pot Max. It's a six quart and it also does canning. So I, I have actually, oops, there we go. The pressure's releasing. I'm going to raise you up just a little bit so that you can see that. Doesn't take long at all. Yeah. And now we have four potatoes done in 35 minutes. We clean them. We got the Instant Pot set up. We put a little water at the bottom, about a half a cup to a cup. And then we put our trivet in. Four potatoes, set it for 35 minutes under pressure. 
cook and hit start. And here we go. We're at the end of the process now. This little red light will quit, will turn off. And that red light is right here. That will turn off whenever the lid is locked, uh, unlocked, excuse me, when it's unlocked, which actually should be any time. Now, from here, your timer starts counting up because it will keep warm. If you see that dial right there, it's keeping warm until you turn it off. And I believe that it stays on the keep warm for two hours. If and then we can open the lid. You cannot get that open until that little red light turns off. That means the lid is locked. Safety mechanisms. That's why I like the Instant Pot so much. And I, I use it pretty much every day, if not every other day, depending on what I'm cooking, because we eat leftovers and we enjoy eating leftovers. So... But yeah, they are a wonderful product. I'm not sponsored by Instant Pot in any way. I just like their products. just want to make sure that that's known. We should be unlocking here anytime. And when we do, I'll reach around here and I will um, open up the, the lid. Everything's unlocked. The light is off. I open this up and make sure you always open it so the steam is pointing away from you. That can be very dangerous. See all that steam coming up? Let a little bit of that water drop off. I kind of will shake it, shake it a little bit. And then it's got some little side holes over here on the handles, and you can just put your lid in and it securely sits there and you don't have to worry about it. So we're going to come over here and we are going to be very careful to not touch anything because it's very, very hot. And there's two little trivets in here. There we go. There's two little handles on the trivet. And we're going to pull those out. And then we're going to move them right over here and set it on the plate. Okay, we we'll get all this in position here. Oh, goodness. Let me get your ears. And you can put more than four potatoes, depending on the size of them. I've put up to six before in here. So um, now whenever we want, we can just pull a potato out and we can use it for whatever we need. So I want to thank everyone for joining me today. If you like the content, there'll be more to come. And we will see you on the next one. Goodbye, everyone. Have a blessed day.